Hey guys, so I didn't feel like vlogging yesterday at all. I was kind of just like in a mood. Um, and I watch YouTube videos most of the day. But I'm back, I'm vlogging. Um, today I actually have something going on, which is nice. Um, I'm going to do my makeup and kind of show you how I do my makeup because why not? I'm not a makeup person, but something to do. Also, I have a... Um, Zoom meeting class at noon. It's 11 right now. So I'm getting ready for that. I have all my content ready. Um, but I am. I was supposed to be teaching at Aveda school, the one that I went to, but since it's closed, they're all doing online stuff. And so I'm gonna zoom in with them and do the class online. So that's what I'm going to be doing. But first I want to get ready and I never do my makeup out here, but I felt like doing it. So, I just washed my face and I put the Charlotte Tilbury, like, Wonder Glow, I think is what it's called, all over my face. Then I'm going to go in with my um, concealer. I don't use foundation, but this concealer is from Maybelline and it's the shade Light. I'm just going to put that on my under eyes and on my problem areas that have like spotting which is always the corner of my mouth uh, I'll put some there because why not let me zoom you in a little bit more okay here we go push my nose ring in will you get this wet a little bit Jeff Jeffrey what that's not the time is that good oh you didn't squeeze it out. Oh, I squeezed it and then hit it and then let it soak it up. No. Oh. <laughs> it just got water everywhere. Oh, that's how you get it nice and saturated. <laughs> Which is true. Yeah, but you don't want it like soaking wet. Okay. No taking. I'll remember that next time. Just dabbing this in, like you see every other makeup person on YouTube doing. So this is nothing new. Nothing at all new. <laughs> Good. I have this cute little case for my beauty blender. Ding. Okay, then I'm going to barely set that with a little powder and a very fluffy brush. This is from e.l.f. Um, and I have no idea what kind of brush it is, so it doesn't say. It's really like fluffy. And I'm using the um, Pacifica Mineral, Mineral Neutralizing Mattifier Shade 1. But it's pretty much translucent, so. I'm just putting that on the spots that I put the concealer on. Then I'm gonna go in with my bronzer. This big e.l.f. brush. And this is the Butter Bronzer in Sunkissed Bronze. And I put this all over my whole face and neck. Because I like to be glowy and tanner and all the above it's gloomy here and I wish I was in Florida so I just put this all over my face and I stay tanner on so my face needs to match my body put a little extra on my cheeks and my nose Okay, now that I am freshly off the beach, I'm gonna go in with my blush. This is like a th three thingy from Tarte. I'm using the shade Prize. It's the blush in it. Dabbing this on my cheeks, on my nose.
just like so. Then I'm going to use the Becca Chloe Malika palette for a highlight. This shade up here is Fierce. Oh, no, wait. Glow Up. Yes. Glow Up right up at the top. And this is a Morphe brush. 510. M510. 510 or whatever, however you want to call it. So I'm going to put my highlight here and around my eyeball. Same on the other side. Look how pretty this highlight is. It's beautiful. Then I'm a big highlight girl, so I do a lot on my nose. Then I do it all over my whole eyelid. And in the corner. Same over here. I'm gonna go on my cupid's bow. So I'm extra, extra glow central. Then I'm going to use get a Morphe M573, or however you say it. And this is the Everyday Faves Ulta Beauty thingy. Like this. And I'm going to take these two shades right here. This one and this one. And I mix them and put this in my crease. And under my lash line in the outer corner. Same on this side. There, there, there. Then I'm gonna get the Surf and Sand from Bobbi Brown. I haven't used this in a long, long, long time. And then this is a flat brush from Wet n Wild. Just looks like this. And I'm gonna use this top shade. As you can see, I've used it a lot. This one is, I don't know, it doesn't say. But it's like the bronzier one up at the top. Just a shimmery bronze shade. I'm gonna put this all over the lid. And work it in the inner corner a little bit. Same on the other side. Just like so. Done and done and done. Gonna flick stuff if there's any falling. Then I'm gonna use go back in with my um, Ulta thingy, and I'm gonna use the darkest shade with a little um, liner brush. This one's from Sony Kashuk, and I'm just gonna do a fake like wingy liner, but with eyeshadow. Just to make my lashes look poppin'. And this is like super subtle. You could use a darker color if you wanted more of a pop, but I don't want more of a pop. Just like that, like barely there. Same over here. Hello. This one eyeshadow is super powdery though. So it makes an absolute mess. Like literally just cakes off, so. If you have a better one, use that one. All right. Same dust anything off. I swear. There's something inside. Then 
we're just gonna curl our little lashes with this. This is from Tarte. It doesn't really matter what you use, just curl your lashes. Mm -hmm. Like so. Then I'm gonna go in with the Tarte Gifted Mascara. Put two coats on of this. Let me move this up here close to me. I like to put mascara on really close to the mirror. I don't know why. Then for lips, mm, what am I gonna use? Which one should I use? Orangier or pink? Feeling pink. I usually feel orange, but this is. Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Stick in Soft Raspberry. Sorry, Clarence, bumped my tripod. Whoa. That's a lot of lipstick. Going with the events little thingy. And then I'm going to put a gloss on. This is... Which one should I use? This one is Elf Lip Plumping Gloss in Champagne Glam. It's like this. Gonna put this all over. I freaking love lip gloss. It's like highlighter for your lips. The sparklier the better. I'm a big glitter person. Okay. That is my finished makeup, and then my hair is a mess and needs to get brushed. But it is freshly washed, I washed it yesterday. It just needs brushed out. Oh my word. But that's my makeup. friends and family welcome back I'm going to make lunch it is almost two o'clock and I have not eaten anything except for a disgusting Nutri-Grain bar so I'm hungry but I am feeling better about myself today because I did a class an online class with my old hair school with their students about social media and assisting and I just really like to teach so I feel better. I'm not as gloomy today. I've got ideas of things I'm going to do for my business while we're in this weird time, so I'm gonna figure those out. Um, but right now, I need food first, so let's go. I'm going to make um, chicken tortilla soup. So, let me just wipe that off so you can see. I have, well, I gotta move this. Okay, um, I'm gonna make chicken tortilla soup. So what you do first is you take some vegetable broth, dump it in a pot. Just like that. We need to empty our trash. And then you're gonna get some water Put some water in there. Kind of like 50-50 vegetable raw, 50% water. Maybe a little more vegetable broth than water. Into the pot. Bring that to a boil. Then you're gonna take another little pan over here. And we're going to put some oil in our pan. 
Do do do. And then make that get hot. Um, while that's getting hot, we're going to cut up some onion and some pepper. These beans and corn are already cooked. This is just to get them warm. And turn that up a little bit. And we're going to add our corn. This is kind of a small pan for all this. But it'll have to do. Then you're going to take your sauce of choice and dump it into the broth. seasoning. Actually, I'm going to use this thing to get it out of the way. Taco seasoning. I have a packet. Dump this thing in. Stir it in. Then we're going to put in some chili powder. Just a little bit. I don't like it too spicy. So it already hurts my stomach like tomatoes do, so if I put too much spice, it hurts it even more. This stuff's too good. Then you're going to turn off your this and put this in there. Dun, 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 dun. Very carefully so it doesn't splash. Just like that. And then stir it in. That's pretty much it. And then I always top it with cheese and more salsa if you want. Sour cream and then these little tortilla chip thingies. If you want, you can, um, if you want like chicken in it. Those chicken strips that we used in the other video for quesadillas, you could cook those on the side and put those in and like shred them up and put them in if you want chicken tortilla soup. But this is kind of just like plain tortilla soup. But yeah. Now I'm going to eat it.
so nice out today, holy cow. Oh, I'm sitting in the sun with the boys. Hello, boys. Hello. Um, rocking on our little patio rocking chair. Jeff's right in there doing work, but I'm taking a break and laying out here because it feels so, 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 so good. I can't even describe it. The sun is amazing. And the weather feels nice. I need to go outside so bad. Perfect baby Clyde. Aw, Clyde, you are so cute lying there. Hey, why don't you go run around? Your frisbee's broken, you chewed a hole in it. Look at his favorite toys, these two. They're frisbees and all this used to be connected so it actually would fly. But he's chewed them apart so they don't fly anymore so I can't throw them. They don't go that far, look. See, just there. These are like the only ones he likes to play with. We have to get them on Amazon and we just get the same ones because they're actually not that durable. Like this thing is so flimsy, it falls apart so quick and he could play for hours, Frisbee. Look how freaking cute you two are, oh my goodness. So they get beat up real fast. Clyde plays defense. Okay, go. See, it doesn't go that far. Don't mind our muddy backyard. We are, we just got this house last year and it was like in the middle of the summer so we couldn't do any landscaping. But I think we're gonna make this tile or I don't know. I would really like to make this like a wooden deck and maybe like steps down here and then some kind of like walkway to the fire pit or I don't know how we're gonna do it. But we do definitely wanna cover this deck up with like an actual wooden deck and then probably steps right here and then like make, like my parents have a really cool one that has like tile on it. So we'll see. Cause they have all out there to play. Right? You love this backyard. Look how freaking cute you are. Why are you so cute right now? Clyde, you are so cute too. Are you happy, boy? Are you happy? It's so nice out and you get to sit in the sun and play. What'd you hear? Well, folks, it's the end of the day. It is 11. Yep, 11. Well, 10.52. We are about to go watch Sleeping Beauty because Jeff has never seen it. Um, and I'm a huge Disney person. Um, so we're gonna go watch that and then go to sleep. Kind of boring, kind of didn't do anything, so. But I just wanted to end the vlog here. Say bye, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share my typical things. You can follow me on Instagram at Hair by Lexi Dawn for my hair page, and then Lex McCracken for my personal page. Everything will be linked down below. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, everyone.